Natalie Nunn and BGC12 star Red have a conversation episode coming out on Zeus Network, and since they have some drama about to air, Natalie has been going on and on about Red on her Instagram page to hype up their upcoming episode on the conversation. Natalie had shared a picture of her bite mark that Red had left during their fight on Bad Girls Club season 13, and if you guys don't know, that's allegedly why Natalie and Red are going to have this conversation because of the beef that they had on Bad Girls Club. Natalie posted the picture of the bite mark and said, Cause you about to see what the happens when you want to play dirty. One thing about me is I'll let time go and catch 100,000 years later with the same mother energy. Natalie also shared a TMZ article back when the incident actually happened and said, it was my arm and TMZ reported that it was my foot because she also put glass in my foot and had removed glass out of my foot. Oxygen did not air that, but she did bite my arm. During the conversation with Zeus, I do mention my foot also had stitches from removing the deep cut. All this while I was fighting Rocky. Red jumped in and she couldn't even fight me one on one. Followed up by a throwback paparazzi video of Natalie talking about the bite on her arm. <laughs> Are you like uh, as squeamish as I am like with needles and stuff? I, I couldn't even look at it. It was really gross. <laughs> My husband uh, recorded the whole thing on Snapchat. I thought it was really <laughs> Super. But, uh, yeah, war wounds. Bad girl stuff. Let me see it. <laughs> you can't see it. It's coming up. Ah, you guys have a blessed day. Yeah. I know I haven't really said much about the whole Red and Natalie conversation that they're going to be dropping soon since they've been dropping all the trailers and sneak peeks, but my thoughts on the whole Red and Natalie conversation are this. Natalie looks super desperate to me, and unfortunately Red fell in her trap of doing something with Zeus because Natalie has been trying to get on the conversation again since the, she got on the first one. However, nobody likes Natalie enough to do the conversation with her. Everybody pretty much hates her, and her feeding for attention is unfortunately for her very obvious to everybody else because most people are just going to pay her because they know she's just being ridiculous. I think that whether it be Winter, Red, Camila, or whoever it was gonna be, Natalie wanted to have a conversation with that Natalie was gonna run up because she wanted that moment because this was one of her first solo type episodes that she's done. Usually when we see Natalie on our screen, it's with an entire cast, but this time it's just her one other person. So the spotlight was on her and she was soaking it all up. I don't even think that Natalie is upset about the bite mark. I think that she's just pretending to be mad and trying to amp herself up to be mad about something that happened six years ago. However, watching the trailers and the sneak peeks, I'm just really glad that Red was smart enough to not sit in the chair when Natalie asked her to sit in the chair because Natalie was definitely going to try to run up on Red when Red was sitting down. And you guys know that Red is a big girl, so it would have took her a little bit of time to get up. And by the time she's getting up, Natalie's already trying to get her little free hits in. So I am glad that Red didn't let Natalie's little sneaky self try to get one over on her by sitting in the chair. I'm really just waiting for this to drop because I'm already knowing it's not going to be as lit as Natalie is trying to make it out to be. She's always overhyping everything and she's known for lying so her hyping this up so much makes me think that it's going to be mediocre and it's not going to be as good as she says it is. Also I'm pretty sure that it's going to be a mediocre fight because Natalie just swings into the air and tries to pull hair so I'm not expecting anything much of this. I can already picture 60 minutes or however long the conversations are of just Natalie trying to talk over Red the whole time and I can already see myself wanting to turn it off in the middle of it. But let me know how you guys are feeling about the conversation between Natalie and Red based off the trailers and all the sneak peeks. Do you guys think that it's going to be any sort of a good conversation or a conversation at all? Also, let me know down below if you guys are Team Natalie or Team Red for this conversation. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. See you in the next one. Bye.